Hello, and welcome to session four of the Photo Booth Owners Netcast. In this session, I am going to show you how to make a purchase and use one of our designs from the design shop. In this session, I will be using Breeze Systems DSLR Remote Pro. If you have not yet visited the design shop, you can find it at photoboothowners.com forward slash shop. I will show you how to locate Breeze Ready Designs, make a purchase, access the downloaded package file, and use it inside of Breeze's software. To get started, let's go to the Photo Booth Owners website. Once we're at the site, we can click the Breeze category link. And this will filter down all the designs to Breeze ready only software designs. We select our design that we'd like to make a purchase of. Select the license we'd like to buy and add it to our cart. From here we can check out like we would on any other e-commerce platform. Once the purchase is made, you will receive an email with a link to download your package. Download it and save it to your desktop as I have done here. You will then want to extract it. I commonly do this by opening it and then dropping the contents onto the desktop. We will go into that now. Inside here we have the template.psd file which is our Photoshop file for making edits to the design. We have a background jpeg and ping to support multiple Photoboost softwares. We have overlay.ping coordinates.txt which gives us the XY width, height, and rotation of all photos in the design. And we have a readme.txt which has information regarding the design, fonts used in it, and for other software packages, uh, internal layout setups. We also will receive uh, inside of here our licensing file. So let's quickly get ready to use Breeze. We'll go into our Breeze prints directory which I've already set up. And I will want to make a copy of my background.jpg. And I will want to paste it into this directory. I should do the right one though. Let's get rid of that. Next, we will go into DSLR Remote Pro. We'll go to the Photo Boost settings. Ensure that custom layout is checked and click the settings. From there, we want to enter the coordinates of our coordinates.txt file. I've already entered these for expedience, so I will close that now. We can hit OK here, and we will do a preview shot. I have my lens cap on, so it will be all black during the uh, photo captures. Now that Breeze has completed with the creation of our print design, or our prints, let's go see what it looks like. So we can go into our prints directory, and we can open it up and view, and here is our pretty new design. <clears throat> and that is it for this session. As you can see, it's quite easy to use one of our designs inside of DSLR Remote Pro by Breeze Systems. If you have any suggestions or requests, I ask that you please leave them in the design request section of our forums. This is also a great place to make requests for general designs. We will do our best to create these designs and meet your needs. With that, I will wrap this session, and until next time, happy boothing, and look for me at photoboothowners.com.